Oh my god, right, okay. So after my initial panic, I have discovered it's a hawk moth. And look how bloody cute it is. Oh, it is, it's mega cute. It's really furry. And I panicked when it fell off the window. So I've just been searching, it's like what, half past three in the bloody morning, me be me. Searching on the grass for it. Because apparently, like with a lot of moths, they don't eat in the uh, random life cycle. But they do drink pollen. And one of the pollen that they drink is tomato. Anyway, it had not fallen all the way to the grass. It had actually landed on the bottom window sill. So I'm gonna take the lovely little fair ball. Oh he's so cute. Oh I can feel his little belly on my finger. Oh can you see how furry he is? Literally just walked straight onto my finger there. Yeah, so I'm gonna bob him onto um tomato plant. Anyway. <laughs> I'm not right in head me, am I? Let's check there's no snails down there. There shouldn't be. There we go. Let's see if he wants to. for you to be upside down. Come here. Calm down. The flowers... If I'll climb up to the flowers. There's no flowers on that one. Come here. Sounds daft, but he probably came and woke me up because we've put this thing over tomatoes and it was zipped down. <laughs> Maybe he came and woke me up to tell me I needed to open it. Is that better? Hey? Eh? Is that better now we can get to tomatoes? Mm hmm. Me coming to wake me up? Yeah. You're happy now. Oh, careful! Where are you going? Right. Yeah, 
They seem to be climbing round all right now. You alright under there? <laughs>